Oh my God, I did it again. Last time I went to record a video, I recorded the whole thing and realized I actually wasn't recording. I just did it again. Luckily I didn't shoot this whole video yet, but anyway, let's get into it. I am going to bring you my favorites for the month of March, 2014. First up is this combination. This is Essie's Sunday Funday and is a really pretty pink, peachy, um, coral color I guess you would say and it's just got the slightest little bit of shimmer to it uh, on its own it's beautiful but if you add Sally Hansen's hard as nails extreme wear in disco ball to the top of it mm, it's so pretty like I so pretty I want to eat it uh, I also have this disco ball color on top of a Revlon like light lilac color and it looks really pretty too but definitely not as gorgeous as these two together um, and I've had this for quite a while and I paired it with other colors but never really thought anything of it until I put these two together and now I'm like in love with this now I want to put this like on top of everything to see if I can re reproduce the beauty that is these two together mm -hmm, mm -hmm. next up is another beauty favorite and that is this combination this is a black liquid liner it's actually Rimmel Rimmel London's Glam Eyes Professional Liquid Liner. I, I only used it once, so I really can't speak to the quality of it, but I just loved the look uh, that it produced by doing a winged, actually it, was, it wasn't necessarily these two things, it was just the, the look that these two produced, which was in my last video, um, which was my makeup collection, I did a black winged liner, I did black winged liner with this lipstick, which is also from Rimmel, and it's like the number 10, but it also says Kate Lipstick Rosetto Rogue Rouge. I don't know how you pronounce that, but it's like this deep red color. So I kind of felt like a, like a 50s pinup girl or, or something. The next favorite is actually an old favorite, but I stopped using it for a little while. I don't even know why. I guess I had kind of given up on my hair for a little while because I get so frustrated with it because it is so thin and fine and, um, this really helps um, the frizz. Like I also, it's also very frizzy. Thin, fine, frizzy hair. What a great combination. But it helps with the frizz and makes it like look like, gives it a little bit of shine. But the best part about this, oh, should, maybe I should say what it is. <laughs> uh, macadamia natural oil healing oil treatment. I feel like everyone knows about this. That's probably why I didn't read off what it was. Um, is the best part is, <sighs> smell, it smells so good. Mm, I just love it. Oh, it smells so good. I could sniff it all day. I think it it is kind of, it almost has a masculine scent to it, I would say, or a very nutty smell. It's not fruity or anything. It's just, it's very like, I would say woodsy, if that's the correct term. I'm not good at describing scents. So yes, love the smell. <laughs> the next up is a food favorite. This is so good. Like uh, Steve is a big fan of Hershey Kisses, like Hershey chocolate and like like hardcore fan um and he actually has switched to eating this over his hershey's which says a lot if you know steve which you don't i do and i'm telling you it's a big deal this is the lint excellence caramel with a touch of sea salt and it's just like it's one the dark chocolate the chocolate itself is good but it's just the combination of the salt with the caramel i don't know i don't know what it is you're gonna have to try it out for yourself if you see it in the store grab it, grab at least a bar and try it because I feel like the majority of people will like this. In fact, when we first discovered it, I'm, I'm glad Steve actually grabbed it just to try it. I was very skeptical. Um, and, but it's got this like little crunch to it. I don't know if it's the crunchiness is the sea salt or the little caramel pieces or both or what, but all I know is it's delicious. On to some clothing favorites. And I wish I was showing you this shirt when it's freshly washed because it's a little wrinkled right now, but this, is uh, actually from my sister. We picked it out together though, but she treated me to it while she was down here visiting. And it's just, the brand is Pink Republic. It was from Kohl's and I got it in a large um, because I, for certain shirts, like I just, I like them to be more loose fitting and it's just uh, the material, it's like really soft and the fit is like flattering. It goes like in at my waist a little and it's a little long um, and it's got like a scooped, not a scooped, but a, like, um, I don't know what you call it, but it like, the bottom like goes like this instead of flat. So I think that looks kind of flattering. 
Um, so yeah, I just, the softness, and then I love the pink stripe color, and it's just overall, like, uh, just overall, I really like it. Another clothing favorite, again from my sister, is this Minecraft t-shirt. Wee! I like playing Minecraft. In fact, I just uploaded two videos to my gaming channel, which is me playing Minecraft in survival mode in order to get better so that I can play other games like UHC and survival games um, because I totally, I played on the Xbox to start and I am not used to the controls on the computer. So I am a, like a kind of a, kind of a noob uh, on the computer version. So if you like Minecraft, go check out the channel. I'll link it in the description. Um, so yeah, I just, one reason I, I mean, of course I love it cause it's Minecraft, but I also love it because it fits me really well. So that's, you know, just the combination of those two things uh, has made me fall in love with that shirt. And then my last clothing favorite, again, from my sister, are these jeggings. And I actually have the same pair on um, and they're black. These are like purple or blue, depending on the lighting that you're in, but they're just so comfortable. And I've worn skinny jeans before, but I've never worn jeggings. And I was missing out all this time because they are so comfortable. And I like to wear something comfortable pants wise because when I'm working at the computer, I tend to want to sit Indian style. So if I'm wearing jeans, it's really awkward to sit that way. So yeah, I'm just, I'm really, I'm really loving these jeggings that she gave me. She didn't want them anymore. Thanks, sis. A TV favorite is The Office. Oh, I love The Office. I am so sad that I'm finished watching. And my last favorite for March is, drumroll, YouTube. I am so in love with doing YouTube. I've been watching YouTube and YouTubers for going on, I feel like, I don't know, five or six years. I don't know the exact amount of time, but vlogging, gaming, beauty, comedy. So I've got four channels now and I just love it. It feels like such a natural thing to me. I love editing. I love recording. I just love all of it. I love every aspect of it. So there you go. Those are my favorites for the month of March. I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. Oh, I totally forgot. I wanted to include a shout out to two new subscribers, Dawn and Kyoko. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing that. Um, what's up? Thank you for watching. Thank you.